and he's always been always Scorpion. So yeah. I think for him, he's the kind of player who's like, I don't have a, I don't have a play style. My play style is whatever Scorpion, Scorpion needs yeah. me to do. <laughs> Scorpion's strongest soldier. MK so Javier. Scorpion jacks again, and on yes. the other side, it is Johnny Chameleon. Deal. We know for a fact that MK Javier has made it no secret that he dislikes playing against Johnny Cage. It's not like this match of battle. Oh wow, that would have been cool. Nice Here we go. First vision of it. That's almost like an old striker meta, but with a little bit of extra Ooh. damage in there. Missed time though from Javier. Scorpion Brox was able to jump out of the ground pound. Hey. Okay, hit confirm. Make it count. Even without a Jax, 370. That's one thing. Scorpion has definitely had some issues in this game, but damage is not one of them. Yeah, and the same thing from Scorpion Prox, taking the last hit of the spin. You're talking before about that yeah, kind yeah, of intricate yeah. matchup. Choice. Knowledge. Not surprised to have seen him <laughs> recognize Ground pound that out of the throw, though, so got the mileage in the end. Ground pound hit eventually. Ooh, but if you get hit at the wrong time, you're taking more damage for it. Right? Okay, hang on, there's the catch. No! Got, it got a little weird. Got a little away from him. That was definitely the kind of pickup that you kind of just got to do stuff on the fly. There's Maybe. a big swing in health in this matchup, too. If you notice, 900 versus 1100 is huge. The extra 100 from Jax lets you play a little bit wilder, where Scorpion Prox does not have much to give. Especially when Javier is so likely to use that any given opportunity, he just do button into spin into Jax. Yeah. Yeah. He's happy to just take that damage. Here's Scorpion Brox. Ooh, Fallen Splot. Denying uh, chip damage. Instant change. Yeah, that was, and that was on Wake Up, too. I'll tell you, you know when you've played against Johnny Cage a lot, that your Fallen Splot is a safe jump. He's out here. Oh, oh what a catch. Good work. That was a down two, right? Yep, you I squeezed it didn't in even see it, right? I just, and I know based on where it hit that it was down two. <laughs> <laughs> like, I didn't see the animation. Oh, cool Jack's too late. That's going to be the tricky thing. It's definitely uh, a specific timing for getting it optimally. Jack's I do like the way you have, yeah, just so constantly threatens that, that forward 3-4, you know, that, that newer string that a Scorpion has. It doesn't, it doesn't even have a gap anymore, so definitely a lot more threatening than it normally would be. And there it is again. Ground yeah, pound. notice Scorpion Prox's health bar. When he eats the ground pound, it's significantly more damage than if he eats only the last hit of spin. Yeah. But it can't be easy to take it. No, that's like a, it's got to be like a one or two frame timing. Yeah. Because like it's like there. a multi-hitting special move. It's like, it's not going to be simple. And if you mess it up, you take so much more damage than normal. And you get the defense from Scorpion Prox. Not getting opened up by any of the significant hits. Most of the damage is actually coming from this right here. And you know, I think that's pretty good because at times, Scorpion... He's there. The boy. Oh, got hit by the, the, the second hit. The board 3-4, but hit again anyway. Oh, oh, huge whiff punish whiff. for the game. Oh, Got him. And that's all it boiled down to. Such a slower pace back and forth, and then one whiff is all it took. Ouch. But at the same time, it, it can historically be quite difficult for Scorpion to get those hits because, again, he's one of those characters that doesn't have a lot of traditional mix-up beyond just, like, strike throw. Yeah. So now you can just bypass it and just get the damage you want by forcing the opponent to deal with the spin. It does mean you're not going to be winning matches very quickly because, you know, Kind of slowly chipping them down with whatever you can get, but uh, on the flip side, if you can find the hit, the damage can be nice. But but he very often spends his cameo meter in this situation right here. I, we haven't yet seen him get you know significant damage into Jack's big combo. That was actually a whip punish on just the standing two as well from Scorpion, which is easier said than done because normally two one is obviously a threat. But Scorpion Prox just knowing you are not going to finish that string, you are sticking out standing two, and that is it. Oh, what a catch! Even with that difference, big need to have Scorpion Prox right now. Ooh, hey, punish. Oh, punish! Oh, I love that choice. <laughs> I love that choice. The, teleport. the awareness there. Yeah, 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 getting him off the ground so we avoid the ground pound and the side switch too. Ooh, hello. Very patient is Javier. Oh, wow, that she reached. But that must that be... Button. That, that's why Javier's throwing it out, because there is that range that Johnny players want to just quickly dash in and right into the edge of standing two. That was a full screen chase. Scorpion Prox from one side of the stage to the other. Javier slowly buzzing away on the other side. 
But this is where the slower style can be a, a bit of a hindrance to Javier is when he has a lot of life to get back and there's not a lot of time left in the round to do it. Yeah, was I mean, there a commitment? There was not. I mean, I understand it. How how else is Scorpion going to get that much health in one go unless he just gets a big combo, right? Fatal Blow is going to do like 300 and something, maybe threaten Hellfire after. Yeah, not a lot of opportunities there to finish off that round if Javier even was able to find a hit. Whip Come punish on. again! Come on, that was so good. Cannot whiff against Scorpion Prox. He is ready every time. And the save jump for the armor. He didn't stick a button out there in the sky. That was a he was able to land and block very well. He had seen oh. that that worked earlier. Hype combos. This is gonna take a while. Here we go grab a drink. <laughs> That's <laughs> great. There. Hearing the Evo crowd do the A. a oh he hit Jack! Oh my goodness. Hang on, okay. I mean, we've seen Javier make these miraculous comebacks. It's, okay, cashing out, spending the damage. Yeah, he wasn't going to be able to set up into Jack's spin either because Jax had just bitten Duffed in the face, so this gives him a little bit of extra time to get that back. Yeah, it's going to be a full Jax meter, but, but you can't afford to take the ground pound yourself. No, true, it Eliminates true. it completely from the rest of the round. Yeah, you're right. He's got to find a true hit. I hope he doesn't muscle memory into it. That would be tragic. Uh oh, no! He called it! Oh! <gasps> that could have been so good, though! Force movement, here it comes! Ah! Oh. Oh. I'm not gonna lie, when I saw Javier go for the bring jacks out, I got I got scared. <laughs> I got nervous. That's, what, that's something I didn't know I needed in my life, was hearing the Evo crowd do oh, the so A, A, A alongside the actual like in-game hype version. Uh, that, there's so many ways that you know that this game is made by big fighting game heads, by big FGC heads, and one of them absolutely is that. Because that <laughs> chant goes back 25 years to old SBOs and old Evos, and everybody at, who works at NetherRealm Studios is knows, knows about that. I remember it. You, it you turn on your custom combo and the crowd goes A, A, A. Of course, we have third strike <laughs> over here on the other side of this uh, very stadium. I love that. I remember we heard it the most in MK9 with Cabal because that one string he did, and then we realized Cabal was the best character in the game, and then Avengers, oh yeah, we should just stop doing it. <laughs> yeah. Otherwise, you just, it's all you'll hear in a round the second he gets you in the corner. Ooh. Oh, hang on. Worked out being quite good for him. And Scorpion Prox, 2-0 lead already. So Javier back to Chameleon. And if I recall correctly, at the Brazilian Major was the first time that I saw him bring out Scorpion Chameleon. Yeah. Mid midway through that tournament, if I recall. And obviously since then, it's become very, very strong as a combination. Definitely had a, just has on paper had a lot more time alone to use the team, but yeah. right now, just looking, just cannot, cannot do anything about avoiding this, this life deficit. Scorpion Brox just Oy. starts things so quickly and just keeps the life lead the entire round and already match point. But this is whiff punishment. This is defense. He will not get opened up. As he gets opened up. <laughs> the main thing though is whip. Oh, whip come on. <laughs> He's got to be seeing real life in like 20% so slower than everyone else. You know what I mean? Like, really how are, is it possible? I mean, some people really do have that. I would not be surprised if he's one of them. Okay. Here's Javier. I definitely don't want to say it's over for Javier. It's looking rough, but it's by no means finished. Ooh, reset. Okay, respectable damage on this too. It's like 200 and something into almost 200, so decent damage together. Got him. On the flip side, though, I feel like Scorpion Prox is actually doing some whiffs of his own that Javier is not able to find the whip punish himself. No, Scorpion doesn't quite have the same exact buttons to whip punish, but. Oh, oh. okay, okay. You know, normally Scorp uh, normally Javier saves that to like the end of a set to close out, but he needs it all right now. Yeah, he just needs to stay in the set, man. Any means necessary. Out of the corner. Scorpion Rock's thinking about where the opponent was going to attack. Please. Oh! <laughs> Doesn't always come back, but it did that time. And Javier has to find something. Again, every round has been the same. Life deficit oh. almost straight away. Big punish. And then a head scratch by Scorpion Prox after he did that. He yeah, might have thought that he still had fan left. Yeah, maybe. Okay, rare footage of just seeing the mid connect, but Javier playing it safe. And that life he dedicates to 1 4 3 2 at the wrong time, it's over. Yep.
came back. Okay, the challenge, the counter. Break it. instantly, of course. Yeah, fantastic delayed mid there from Javier. Gets the low fire. Hang on, this might be the round. Yeah, Scorpion Prox looking frustrated with that. Very Maybe. interesting to watch the change available just based, based on Cameo. Obviously, that's the game. It's a huge, huge part of the game. But knowing how Javier wanted to play with Jax. Spin into ground pound. It's very like, uh, you know, using using that over and over again. It's a very one-dimensional aspect of his gameplay. But you know that he has all the rest of the dimensions available. And this pick in Chameleon has really let him, him bring that stuff out. Definitely the team he's seen the most success with overall, I would say, is the Chameleon pairing. Because it just it lets Scorpion do... It gives him a lot of craziness. And I know you can say that about Chameleon with almost anyone, but for Scorpion particularly, he is not a crazy character in this game. Yeah. But with Chameleon, he can be that way. And that's, that is a playstyle that Scorpion players are familiar with and tend to enjoy, so... No stranger to it is Javier, who has managed to bring the things back, so two to one. By no means is this over. I think that last game, we definitely saw Scorpion Prox being a little bit too comfortable, I think. Mm. Oh, oh my goodness! Comfort. That if he even meant to do it, I don't know. Oh, it worked out. So if anyone asks, yes. Good work with the glow. Going to be into point blank pressure yet again. Oh, Got him. step back. That's not dead, break? right? Yeah, yeah, it has to break. I actually think that may have killed. Man, this was such. Okay, hang on a minute. Oh, back to he back! Did. I was worried. I was worried for a minute there for Javier. That was looking like such a massive life lead in Scorpion Prox this close Fight. to snatching it back with a comeback. Very smart end of that combo, too, to put himself out of the corner. A little bit of extra awareness. I feel like Javier is being a little bit less likely to, to swing out these buttons now, though. I think those earlier whiff punishes really kind of drilled into him by now. He's being a lot more careful when he chooses to throw those standing twos out. Nice catch here. Decent damage. And the dash up into Got nothing. Him. Taking those three bars right away. There's a fan left to think about Ooh. on the other side. Oh, here it comes. Up to call out the teleport cancel too and then up block the jump kick. That was clean defense from Scorpion Prox. Uh oh. Okay, hang on. Oh, what a throw tech. Ooh. Let's go. Oh, no! no. <laughs> yeah. And again! again. Huge! And he's got a lot of damage on deck. This could be reset scenario or do you just. <gasps> okay, th th that was reset into Katana Fan Lift. That might have sure, killed the sure, yep. too. It scales, but. You get some damage. Hang on a minute. There's Glaive. Yep. Whoop. Again. Whoa. Can't take anything though. Don't help. Even Chip. It. Oh, he put himself. So no. No, he's out. Lift. What is Come going on? on? And back three of all buttons from three quarters screen. What was that exchange? Wasn't enough. That was like some Dragon Ball Z. Yeah, that was a choreograph looking right. <laughs> <laughs> that was so good. And that was, I've, I've never seen back three connect from so far away. That low, that long low. Very far, yeah. Oh, I was so worried at the end. Oh, and the, the immediate switch to Baraka. Okay. The immediate change. This is, this is the character that Scorpion Prox has played more than anything else in MK1. Especially with the Kano pairing, but already a game five, the return. Couldn't get a trade combo. Yeah, Kano was there. So as a result, it's pressure, corner, control. There's the flawless. So important to see as we discussed before. I feel like one of the main things that's changing in this set is Scorpion Prox. He's just getting hit by more four threes. He's just getting hit by more mids and it's leading to that big damage. Oh, he hit Kano as well. <laughs> that was a chunky down to, uh-oh. Imagine uppercutting Kano while he's in the ball. Hit him like a golf ball. Oh. Yeah? Can you teleport out of this probably? Yeah, there you oh, go. No, not at all. That was a bit too ambitious. Oh, hey. oh, oh, okay. So, man, what a reversal of fortunes. It was match point Scorpion Prox when he was up 2 0. Oh, and just like fashion that, it's been well. a reverse 2 and a half 0 oh, so far. A dominant 2-0 lead as well. It was. He was so killing Javier it. to bring this back slowly but surely. And now up in the set. Can he close it out though? That is the question. Yeah, good patience. And again, 
Javier's timing on these teleports have been so throwing off Scorpion Pro. There was one moment that we saw him get like an up block punish on teleport and jump kick, and that's it. Everything else has been all advantage Javier on this teleport. Putting on the glow so he doesn't have to worry about the knives. As a result, it's ball. Ooh, okay, max range standing too. Uh-oh. Yeah, it's not huge damage, but when you got this life lead, it is enough. Hang on a minute, though. Standing two, Baraka, Scorpion Prox. Manages to find it. Oh, cancelled. That was cute. Trying to get tricky. Grabs out of the corner. Javier very close to being able to do this thing. Scorpion Prox in trouble. He'd love to get three South American players in the top six. Okay, again the grab. At this point, the breaker wouldn't save you because if you get grabbed again, it's pretty much over. Even chip. Mounting. Grab is gonna do it for Javier. The complete reverse 3-0. To what? take it and to guarantee himself winner's side top six. What a turnaround for the Scorpion player from Spain. Fantastic showing. Reverse sweep against Scorpion Prox of all players. Oi. Scorpion guaranteed winner's side top six. Yeah. Say that out loud again. Scorpion of all characters. Not Scorpion Prox.